Vincent Carchietta, USA Today Sports after defeating Loyola 54-41 in the first round of the NCAA tournament on Friday, Ohio State will have to pull off an upset on Sunday if it's going to reach the first Sweet 16 of Chris Holtman's tenure. The Buckeyes' second round matchup, tip-off time and network TBA, will be played against Villanova, the Big East tournament champion and the number two seed in the South region, who defeated Delaware in its first round game in Pittsburgh on Friday. Villanova is one of the nation's hottest teams, having won 11 of its last 12 games, and the Wildcats who have a 27-7 overall record this season, have a history of success in the NCAA tournament under longtime head coach Jay Wright. Led by Big East Player of the Year Colin Gillespie and five other players who have also averaged more than nine points per game this season, the Wildcats are an efficient offensive team that can attack opponents from every position on the floor. Limited depth and size, however, could make them beatable if the Buckeyes play their best basketball. Only three losses in last two months after starting the season just 7-4, which dropped the Wildcats to 23rd in the AP Top 25, Villanova has been on a tier ever since. Dating back to December 21, Villanova has won 20 of its last 23 games, including its last six in a row. For the season as a whole, the Wildcats have won 10 games against teams in this year's NCAA tournament field, two against each of Creighton, Providence, Seton Hall and UConn, plus a November win over No. 3 seed Tennessee and Friday's win over number 15 seed Delaware, while all seven of their losses have come against teams who made the tournament as no lower than a 9 seed, one loss against each of no. 1 seed Baylor, number 3 seed Purdue, number 4 seed UCLA, number 5 seed UConn and number 9 seed Creighton, plus two losses against number 9 seed Marquette. By comparison, Ohio State has won nine games against tournament teams but has lost five games to non-tournament teams. Villanova's only losses since the start of 2022 were a 57-54 loss to Marquette on January 19, an 83-73 loss to Marquette on February 2 and a 71-69 loss to UConn on February 22. Six scoring threats The Wildcats star is Gillespie, a fifth-year senior guard who earned Big East Player of the Year honors this season for the second year in a row. Going into the NCAA tournament, Gillespie averaged 15. 9 points, 3. 8 rebounds and 3. 3 assists per game this season while shooting 44. 3% from the field, 42. 2% from the three-point line and 89. 4% from the free-throw line.